how we lose weight and why we lose weight is what we talk in this video and I show you shortly the most important things that you need to know that you are an expert when it comes about weight loss. Okay, let's get started. Now you see here in the corner our basic weight loss. Just follow my cursor where I'm gonna read here for you and you're gonna see now the time how fast you can deliver to your client all the information that are needed that you are in front of the client not only one step ahead a couple of steps ahead and talk like an expert point number one drink water two to four liters one liter per 25 kilogram body weight you have 25 kilograms drink one liter 52 75 300 kilo four liters roundabout number two veggies eat one to two kilogram veggies a day five meals every three hours okay if you say that's too much i cannot eat in the morning how to eat so much give him an example with the cucumber you just take a small cucumber and tell him look you see that cucumber here eat it cut it in five pieces one piece in the morning one piece you leave left in your home when you come back one in the morning every two hours a small piece of cucumber because that's what makes your metabolism working and then you will see one thing then he will say yeah, but this starving, it's not enough food, so I was starving. No, so that's the point, you can eat two cucumbers, you can add meat, you can add some cheese, but no carbs that makes you fat. Low carb or zero carb, what's also called ketogenic diet, is the best way to lose fat because carbs is equal sugar, is equal diabetes, and that we will talk all about this in this video. So let's go ahead, how you proceed. Meat or cheese, is that what you can eat? As a source of protein veggies is the source of vitamins so we don't need fruits too much fruit sugar fruit sugar uh, fruit sugar is fructose and alcohol is made also from fructose so it's the same thing and here on the corner you see sugar the bitter tuber you can see more about all of these topics okay next point how much meat you have to eat because we say two gram of protein for each kilogram body weight but then you don't know how much meat to eat, just how much protein you have to take in. You can calculate it. You have 80 kilogram by two gram, it's 160 gram what you need. But I have a better formula for you guys. It's like eating meat 0.5 up to one kilogram a day. This is really the best. You know, this is the, if you do everything perfect, I know you will be not able eating so much. Even me, I'm not eating every day one kilogram, but that's why to show you can eat one to two kilogram of veggies every day and one kilogram of meat so if you're not starving you see you can eat a lot diet is not necessary for weight loss we do an amazing tasty healthy nutrition with amazing barbecue nice food tasty food barbecue vegetables that makes you fit and strong and you will melt your body fat i promise you if you follow up with this process here you will melt your body fat okay how much meat we eat 0 0.5 to 1 kilogram a day that means 100 gram as you see here per 10 kilogram body weight I'll mark it here that's that area here 100 gram per kilo per 10 kilogram body weight so that means you have 50 kilograms as a girl you eat 500 gram of meat you are 100 kilogram as a man you eat 10 kilograms meat okay Uh, one kilogram sorry 1000 gram okay so 50 kilogram 500 gram 60 kilograms 670 780 890 900 and 100 kilograms one kilogram of meat 1000 gram okay the next thing is you need fibers fibers are from the family of the carbohydrates but doesn't make you fat don't have the same effect that not carbohydrates at all Two times a day is more than enough and the best source of fibers is linseed and avocado that are the number ones what i suggest you to take point number five every three hours five times daily that's what you need and then here is coming the expert secrets that makes you now a, a, a couple of levels higher okay so now let's get to the next level and let's become an expert that's what we do now okay metabolism training that is called 
at body time in our motivated fit program m5x metabolism five times a day eating that's why m5x and that's i will explain also this graphic here in my next video where we want to talk about this okay now let's go ahead with what's mentioned here so the same thing what i was telling you before two gram protein per kilogram body weight and this is to protect your muscles for not losing them eat five times a day no time um okay so small cucumber as i tell you five times daily not enough starving you can eat more exactly what we talked before it's mentioned here in a short line okay um the next point how much kcal you can take in this is the simple rule if you consume 3000 calories and we have a kcal calculator online that i gonna put on youtube under this video description below in the description area you found the link to the kcal calculator where you can calculate how to calculate all of these things and i will make also a video about the kcal calculator how to use the kcal calculator so follow up with my next videos as i told you we want to talk everything in detail step by step here what you need to know to be a successful weight loss expert at body time okay let's go ahead with the next point what means seven uh, how much calories to take in if your consumption is 3000 okay so you will take in only 2000 that there is a difference of 1000 okay this is what we need if you have a difference of 1000 that means you burn 1000 calories every day from your own body you will need that energy because you consume 3000 you take in only two there's a difference of 1000 your body you know needs that energy and you don't feed him with that energy so he will start using this energy from your own body from the fat deposit and that's what you're gonna reach okay um next point is carbs to reach to the best fat burning effect is also very important that you don't eat carbs okay what means carbs imagine you have a deposit where you save carbs here and a deposit where you save fat here if you eat carbs this will be used as fast energy and it will be deposited here okay the body gonna use the energy and if you hit more carbs you're gonna save it here to use it for later the energy over the day and you will not use the energy from the fat deposit and that's why we want to keep this deposit empty that the body 24 hours will start using your own body fat because that's what you want to burn what you want to burn your body fat right got it okay let's go to the next point how we burn one kilogram body fat if you have one kilogram fat somewhere in your body how you burn that i'm going to explain you now you have to know one thing one kilogram body fat as you see here have 7000 calories so you need to burn 7000 calories and that's why i said nutrition is the key to success you cannot do it with cardio because now if you go on a bicycle stepper cross trainer you will burn in one hour 500 calories so that means to burn one kilogram fat you need to stay on a bicycle 14 hours impossible right so that's why we do it through the nutrition because 3000 you consume 2000 2000 we take in 1000 is the difference by seven days it's 7000 so one kilo we're gonna melt every single week what means four kilogram in a month by 12 months what means 48 kilograms 52 weeks one 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 year have so 52 kilograms in a year and that's an amazing result and this you can achieve without doing any kind of sport just through nutrition that's the secret of weight loss you can do sport so much as you want i promise you, you will not lose weight if you take more energy in and eat the wrong food because you will always over and over gain 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 weight you have to stop gaining weight and train your metabolism that you will start burning fat traps dangerous there are a couple of traps that we have to avoid in our daily life number one juices you think juice is healthy you think you take some vitamins no juices are making you gain weight and makes you fat why because they have a lot of carbs and a lot of energy imagine you drink one orange juice or one apple juice there are five oranges or five apples better eat in the morning one apple if you want to have some fruits or one orange orange okay but don't drink the juices you don't need juices your entire life kick them out of your nutrition no juices and 
the best way to get vitamins again as i was saying in the point number two veggies the same amount of vitamins maybe more vitamins than fruits and not that big amount of carbs that makes you fat sugar kills you sugar is cancer diabetes high blood pressure forget about it sugar is very dangerous avoid sugar supplements which supplements are good to use which supplements to use there is three five main supplements that are the best for muscle gain it's glutamine arginine protein for weight loss it's a must-have alcanitine and chitosan so from my experience what i want to suggest to you you can take even all five of them even for weight loss because during a weight loss process as i say all the time there is one thing what you want to avoid losing muscles you're going to lose your fat you're going to burn fat and not muscles you're going to keep your muscles so if you take protein protects your muscles if you take arginine protects your muscles if you take glutamine that is one of the best amino acids to protect your muscles and it's increasing your immune system and a lot of other benefits it's uh, giving you pump it's cleaning your blood it's doing a lot of amazing things in your body so take all these five supplements and you will have a booster for your fat burning which vitamins you need to boost the weight loss results and the vitamins are so important because they are uh, increasing in your body a lot of things like your immune system uh, your metabolism um, the cell situation uh, cleaning your blood making your blood stream to work faster and it's so important i don't want to go too much in medical details now you need these vitamins very important we start with number one go to the live pharmacy there you get it it's zinc you need zinc in the highest concentrations how to take it in each of the supplements i'm showing you now here you see on the back side just take it like that take some zinc it's not important which one from which um, company or however zinc highest concentration plus minus it's not so important important is that you take it number two multivitamin everyday one as explained on the back side for each supplement always the same as explained on the back side you take it in every day next one vitamin d3 the most important thing because we don't have enough vitamin d3 everywhere in this world because we are people who stay at ac we not stay all the time at the beach vitamin d3 you get from the sun if you stay in the sun number four vitamin c increasing your immune system and a lot of other benefits take it as mentioned on the back side vitamin c very important and this is also one of the most important things omega-3 you need it no omega-6 no omega-9 just omega-3 take it as mentioned on the back side why omega-3 why not six and nine because omega-6 you found in all your food all but omega-3 not what you have to have the balance between omega-6 and omega-3 the relation have to be same one piece three one piece six and we don't have this relation we have just omega-6 and not omega-3 that's why we need to increase it and omega-3 you found just in salmon for example in fish and not in all kind of fish because salmon only who eats natural in the sea and which food is made natural nowadays it's all food is full of chemicals so and the fish get uh, corn and they grow up in the industrial so forget about it you need omega-3 the next one is a product that i know from germany it's called basen citrate in germany the english definition i'm so sorry i don't found on the internet but it's a mix of following ingredients it's calcium as you see it here magnesium zinc vitamin d3 and calcium. i found that one here it's missing calcium. it's not so good so go and found something where you have all these five ingredients that will be amazing and then we go to vitamin number seven it's that one here astaxanthin astaxanthin is that one if you want to know more about all these products why they are so good ask in the pharmacy they're going to explain you why astaxanthin is so important for your cell uh, situation because in the pharmacy they're going to tell you one thing it's for the eyes yes eye products always have astaxanthin but in our case and that's also what happens for the eyes because it's making the situation of your cells it's repairing our cells and we need our cells we have muscle cells fat cells we have cells in on our organs everywhere we have cells 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 and we need to improve the cell situation okay and the last one is chlorella 
or spirulina. I have no chlorella. You can do it like one month this, another month the other one. It's a powder. We take it as mentioned on the back side. And these are the eight vitamins that you need to take daily. Follow up with this. And now we go to our last point. Also very important. If you still not lose weight, just make the customer a picture of all this blood tests here and make a blood test where you get all these values here to see if they are in the right balance. You know, you have an interval, they have to be in between this value and this value and see with your doctor if all this um, tests come out positive and you are in the right interval and if not he's gonna advise you exactly what to take in and how to get the treatment because if this is not in balance in your body if you don't have for example um, if you have HDL and LDL or you have um, uh, a low thyroid you know then of course you cannot lose weight so that's why these things are very important go to your doctor and check that if you don't lose weight and then we will lose weight definitely it can be fixed so there's no any issue just do it go make the bl uh, blood test and you're gonna see what what went wrong now do me one favor please go on youtube you see here sugar the bitter truth watch this video one and a half hours very long very informative it's everything very very true it's a video from robert lustig and he talked about carbs sugar the bit of true how dangerous they are you have to know that then you will start reducing your carbs understanding why sugar kills you okay sugar as we said before is cancer obviously diabetes so watch the video you will see why you will believe it then later on and you will start changing your life stop it, living this dangerous life controlled by some people who want to make us sick because the industry makes too much money well, now let's go to the next point. And now we talk about the graphic M5X. What is this? M5X looks on the first, how many things are here difficult, but I'm gonna explain it for you step-by-step, step, very easy. First, you see in the corner, the check mark with green. Yes, these are the products you can eat. Meat, cheese, vegetables. As we mentioned before, one to two kilogram, meat and cheese one kilogram, and seeds. Here it's a shortcut. It's a blueprint that shows you exactly everything we was talking till now, okay? So M5X means metabolism, five times eating per day. That's why 5X, metabolism 5X. This is the training, metabolism training, what we do. Okay, let's get started. A human being here, okay? You have a brain, you have your body. And what happens in your body and with your brain, we're going to talk now. So every time when you eat something, for example, on the left side, the good food, or the right side, the bad food, this food is going to go into your digestive tract and there the food is going to be digested and metabolized. You have to imagine one thing. Metabolized, what means? Metabolism, you can imagine there's one guy, there's this superhero in your stomach. And every time if you put some food inside your mouth, Food goes in your stomach, and then this guy has to wake up and start working, okay? Start to cut the food, you know, and open it and make it into pieces that you're, it's going through your metabolism. Then you can imagine you have a net, this net here. Through this net, all the ingredients, what you're eating, because it's coming as a long chain of molecules when you eat something, and it cannot go through this. If you eat sugar instead, it's coming just simple sugar molecules and it goes fast through directly in your bloodstream because all your food, what you are eating is coming protein, fat and carbs only. And here you see also K-Cal, how much calories have protein, how much have fat and how much have carbs that are equal to sugar and fast energy. What's going into your bloodstream? This is fast energy, this is slow energy. And we say also that whole grain products have are good carbs and sugar are bad carbs but for me even the whole grain whole grain products so bread and brown bread and everything it's always sugar and let me give you the truth why this brain is why this bread is also sugar look let's say you take some bread in your mouth you chew on it and with, uh, with the um, saliva in your mouth through the amylase you know you're gonna metabolize that 
bread, you're gonna open it. It's gonna happen the same thing like in your stomach, you know, when you get something metabolized. Now through your saliva, through the amylase in your mouth. And if you chew it 10 to 20 minutes, you know what's gonna happen? You will see the bread becomes sweet. It tastes sweet. So now you see it's sugar after it gets metabolized. So the fact is, as you see here also, glucose in your bloodstream, everything you eat, carbs, is equal sugar because it comes as glucose in your bloodstream. And the crazy thing is, we have cancer cells in our body, as you see here, all the time. But our immune system, as you see here in this picture, gonna fight that cancer cells that they don't grow, they will nothing happen, they kick them out of our body, okay? So, but all the time we have cancer cells inside, and coming new and new and new, okay? And they will be kicked out. But now, I wanna tell you one thing. These cancer cells doesn't grow because our immune system fight them, okay? But, to grow, you know what they need? They feed themselves to get energy, and energy is sugar from sugar, glucose. So as long as you eat carbs in high amount, you feed them with glucose, with sugar, and feed them to grow and kills you. That's why you know that every second person in this life get the diagnosis cancer. That's the true what happens in this life. And that's why you have to understand and to watch the video Sugar the Bitter Truth that you know why these things happen, why so many people get cancer. Every second person from two person, one person will get diagnosis cancer one time in their life. This is the truth. Go and check the statistics. Stop eating the things that gonna kill you. Sugar is diabetes, cancer, obesity, high blood pressure, heart, heart attack. Okay, let's go ahead. What happens in the bloodstream after you eat something and the bad sugar comes into your bloodstream, the glucose. Let's go ahead to see what happens. The glucose goes to your pancreas and stimulates the pancreas to produce insulin and sends insulin to the cells. Insulin, you can imagine, is like a key who opened this cell that protein, fat, and glucose can go inside the cell, as you see here. And in this cell, you can imagine there is some power stations that are gonna produce energy that are the mitochondria, as you see here, mitochondria. And these are producing the energy, the ATP that you need during your day, during your workout, however. And now, when the cell is open, and this is good, what happens to now? Protein, fat, and glucose go inside. But what happens if you eat too much sugar? Too much carbs and you always gonna send all the time insulin to your to your cell if you attack yourself with insulin all the time the cell will say stop and become insulin resistant and when your cell becomes insulin resistant you know you eat protein and fat and uh, glucose is coming through your bloodstream also in the body in the carbs and they have to go in the cell you know in your power station so there is no choice the cell have to be open, so the pancreas, as you see here, gonna start send more insulin to your cell, more and more and more and more and more and more and more, and now you get um, you are not in balance anymore with your insulin and glucagon uh, level, and you become diabetes. You get diabetes. That's what happens now. You get diabetes, and that's how it's diabetes created, and that's why we have to avoid this to uh, get too much insulin hormones in our body that gonna stimulate uh, that gonna reach our cells okay we have to protect our pancreas not um, producing so much insulin okay the next point is as you see here the crazy thing is in the same time during our body gets all the nutrition protein fat carbs glucogen and all this happens from our cells they're gonna be sent a hormone this is the craziest thing. Listen very properly what happens now. It's called leptin to our brain. And this hormone, leptin, you know what happens in our brain now? This hormone says to our brain, we are starving. So during we eat now a lot of carbs, fat, protein, so we take in a lot of calories. Our brain is telling us that we are starving. And that's what happens when we eat sugar, you know? Because any eat sugar, eat protein, Eat fat, it's fine, but the good fats. You have saturated and non-saturated fat. You need the saturated fats, not non-saturated. And if we eat now sugar, 
That's why it's a drug. You eat a lot of calories and you start having that feeling that you are starving. You want to eat more and more and more and more. That's what happens when you eat carbs equal sugar. So no sugar. Let's go ahead to the last point. I have to explain you here, guys. There is one more thing because some people say, yes, but carbs are not carbs. They are the good carbs and the bad carbs. And the good carbs, the whole brain carbs, they have a good glycemic index. True. But it's not about the index. It's about the glycemic load. Because let me tell you what's the difference between glycemic index and glycemic load. Glycemic index means like uh, this product, how fast it's going to be absorbed in your body and how much insulin goes to your um, cell, you know, because this we have to decrease the amount of insulin during the day. So what happens? Let me explain. It's very simple. When you eat sugar, it's coming a quantity of, let's say, um, 100. Okay. This quantity of 100 goes direct to the pancreas and the quantity of 100 insulin a unit, okay? 100 insulin units goes to your cells. In the same time, boom. And this is very bad, yes, because it's a big amount. But if you eat whole grain, the good carbs, it's a long chain of molecules. You can imagine there's some pearls, on it and another, that is going down to your net, and the metabolism cuts it, that this pearls falls down, okay? So what happens now? This chain of pearls stay there, because it's a, it's a, it's a long structure of the whole grain, the good carbs. But now it's the same amount of insulin, it's 100 units insulin what will uh, uh, reach to your pancreas and the pancreas, it's not insulin, it's glucose. But the pancreas is going to produce 100 units insulin to send to your cell. So now what's going to happen? This 100 units will not come in the same time. It will come like, you know, every 10 minutes a little, 10. After 10 minutes again, 10. After 10 minutes again, 10. Something like that, over 4 hours, as long as it takes, you know. So it will be every 30 minutes, for example, 10 units, 10 units, 10 units. But after this period of time, the same amount of insulin going to attack your cell. This is the same. It's the same, you know, it's same like, and this is even, even, even worse, because imagine one thing, if somebody makes you angry with one word and one word and again and again, you will, you will went crazy. If somebody attacks you once and then he will start it's even better, you know, it's, it's being permanently attacked, 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 attacked. And that's why this is what happens when people make mistakes and misunderstood glycemic index and the glycemic load. This topic here we will talk many times and I will make more videos about that. We are going to explain you more in detail uh, with better quality and it will improve this knowledge here, what is the basic and first knowledge, what you need to understood, how it works. And now I want to show you one more thing a shortcut how fast you can see all the process what's working here when you are in front of the client you see it takes just a few minutes let's say how long let's see how long time it takes okay one water two to four liter one liter per 25 kilogram body weight two veggies one to two kilogram five meals every three hours three meat and cheese 0 0.5 to one kilogram 100 gram per 10 kilogram body weight Four, fibers, two times a day, linseed and avocado is down one. Five, every three hours, five times daily, you take all of this nutrition. This is the basic weight loss. Let's go to the expert secrets. Six, metabolism training. Five X, you see the graphic, what you explain later. Two gram protein, kilogram body weight, protect your muscles for not losing them. Eat five times a day, no time, can't eat so much. Okay, one small cucumber, cut it in five all day. Now we will say not enough, starving. Okay, number seven, KCAR, deficit. 2,000 take in, if you consume 3,000, calculate online how much you take in. That will be the next video. Carbs, you have to keep your carbs empty, that you burn your fat and not use your carbs as a primary energy. Okay, what means fat? One kilogram body fat have 7,000 calories. To burn 7,000 calories, bicycle is 500 calories. Stepper, cross the same 500 calories means 14 hours running. Too much, we cannot do that. That's why the deficit of 1,000 calories in seven days, we burn 7,000 calories equal one kilogram fat. Traps and danger, orange juice, apple juice, avoid. Sugar kills, carbs is equal sugar, cancer, obesity, diabetes. Supplements to take in, glutamine, arginine, protein, alkanitine, chitosan. The first three, muscle gain, second, weight loss, but I prefer all of them to take even during your weight loss program. Vitamins, zinc, multivitamin, vitamin D3, vitamin C, omega-3, base citrate, what's calcium, magnesium, zinc, vitamin D3, calcium mix, astaxanthin, and chlorella or spirulina. So easy. If you're still not losing weight, make this medical test with all these values here. 
okay, and watch the YouTube video Sugar the Bitter Truth. Then we go to the M5 X probing. This is what you are allowed to eat: cheese, meat, veggies, seeds. Okay, uh, bread is same as sugar. If you chew it, you will see after 10 20 minutes it becomes sweet in your mouth. So carbs are sugar. Any kind of carbs are sugar. Any kind of carbs are bread, potatoes, rice, pasta, bananas, fruit, sugar, fruits. All of these things is killing you. It's very dangerous for your body. Okay, what happens in your body? Everything you eat goes to your stomach, digestive tract, where you have the metabolism. This metabolism guy gonna cut the food into small pieces. You have a net where it's falling down and goes into your bloodstream. Into your bloodstream, everything comes inside as glucose. You have all of these things inside and we talk here just about glucose. Glucose is the dangerous part. It's equal sugar, it's carbs. Okay, what happens with the glucose? Glucose goes to your pancreas, stimulates your pancreas and sends insulin to the cell that Insulin is like a key, open the cell, that the nutrition like protein and fat and glucose can go inside and produce energy in the mitochondrion like ATP. And if you eat too much sugar, you're gonna send too much insulin to your cell and your insulin cell can become insulin resistant and that means you make diabetes. Okay, glucemic increase and glucemic load means quite the same because you will send the same amount of insulin over a long or a short time period. So it's by the end the same what comes to your cell. It's the same. If you, if you have like uh, products with a good glycemic index, okay, then comes 100 units insulin in four hours, okay? If you have products with a bad glycemic index, 100, same amount of, of sugar, of course, 100 units of insulin will come not in four hours, like every 30 minutes, 10, 10 units, it will come in one big shot, like 100 units in the first 30 minutes. That's what's gonna happen, okay? And uh, we have cancer cells in our body all the time. So the cancer cells are important to know one thing, they eat sugar. So why you give them that much carbs that they can grow? And shocking true, two persons from two people, one get once in a life the diagnosis cancer. So let's avoid this. The chain of molecules, sugar simple molecules, is a chain, it's gonna be cut it, and explain. And at the same time, when insulin comes to your cells in big amounts, and you eat sugar, that's what then happens in your body, your body gonna sense a hormone to your brain that's called leptin and gives you the signal and the feeling that you are starving and you wanna eat more. That's why sugar is a drug and makes you addicted to eat more and more and more and more and more. During your eating, you feel like starving. Protein, fat and carbs have four, nine and four kcal, as you see here, this is the fast energy. And now we talk about all of these things as you see in four minutes only. It's so fast. It's five minutes, knowledge, you learn it. Every time you have a client in front of you, you go through this information. I was doing it here now twice and you are an expert now because you understand how to lose weight and why you lose weight. I hope you enjoy this video, learn it and the most important part, watch it again and again and again. This video is with a lot of, it's full loaded with knowledge. You have to watch it, not only one. You have to watch it over and over again. You have to repeat it because otherwise, it will not go in your brain. You have to make a train to write it down, make notes, even if you have everything written here, make notes for you also to go in the subconscious mind. Repeat it and practice it that you can talk like me now in front of you, in front of the customer, talking like an expert, not like an expert. You are an expert if you learn these things. Become an expert, you will see things gonna change. If you talk about these things, this is what we are offering now. Now you will understand also the following thing, what you see now here in the picture about our Service categories. If a client wanna do just standard, it's just MS training, we have, don't have this consultation. But that's why we recommend you to do one thing. Take the silver package, okay, the middle one. Because here, we're gonna explain you this properly and we're gonna train with you this properly and we're gonna check every week if you follow up with your nutrition and what's missing and what not. And more of these things will come soon in my only coaching program where I'm gonna teach you in details more and more and more about Motivated Fit program, how to lose weight, fast track to success. Sounds that great? That's what we do and that's the future in 2020 at Body Time. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to get subscribed. Facebook, YouTube, Instagram. Hit the um, notification bell button to get all my new videos immediately and to be always on track with what happens. Thank you.